Rhea Ripley may be stripped of her women's championship after breaking long-standing WWE rule. Rhea Ripley, the formidable women's champion, has been raising eyebrows within the WWE universe due to her absence from title defenses in recent times. As per a long-standing WWE rule, a champion is required to defend their title every 30 days, but Ripley's reign has surpassed this time frame without any defense in sight. The situation has sparked discussions among fans and WWE officials alike, leading to rumors that Ripley may be at risk of losing her coveted championship. Ripley's meteoric rise to the top of the women's division came to a triumphant climax at WrestleMania, where she captured the women's championship in a thrilling match. Since then, she has displayed unwavering dominance and has actively competed across WWE's flagship shows, Raw, SmackDown, and NXT. However, her failure to defend the title in over a month has prompted concerns that she may not be living up to the responsibilities that come with being a champion. While Rhea Ripley's undeniable talent and imposing presence have solidified her as a top-tier competitor, the importance of regularly defending the championship cannot be overlooked. Title defenses add excitement and prestige to the division, providing opportunities for other superstars to challenge for the title and potentially elevate their careers. By not adhering to the 30-day rule, Ripley risks undermining the prestige of the women's championship and potentially robbing deserving contenders of their rightful shot at the title. WWE officials have yet to make an official statement regarding Ripley's situation, but there is speculation that they may consider stripping her of the women's championship if she fails to schedule a title defense in the near future. Such a decision would undoubtedly be met with mixed reactions from fans, as many have grown fond of Ripley's reign and appreciate her captivating performances. However, some argue that taking away the championship from Ripley would not be necessary, given her talent and star power. Instead, they propose that WWE should provide a clear explanation for the lack of title defenses and work with Ripley to ensure she upholds her duties as a fighting champion moving forward. Regardless of the outcome, it is evident that Rhea Ripley's reign as women's champion has been a remarkable one, showcasing her potential to be a long-term face of the division. Still, the 30-day rule remains a crucial aspect of WWE's championship landscape, and maintaining its integrity is essential for the overall credibility of the titles and the sport itself. As SummerSlam approaches, the spotlight is firmly on Rhea Ripley, and her future as the women's champion hangs in the balance. WWE fans eagerly await updates from the company regarding this situation and hope to see Ripley return to the ring soon to defend her championship against a worthy adversary. The future uncertain for Rhea Ripley, will she be forced to defend her women's championship? In recent weeks, Rhea Ripley has undeniably been a force to be reckoned with in the WWE's women's division. Her dominance in the ring has left the other female competitors struggling to keep up, making her an imposing champion. However, with her absence from SummerSlam and a lack of recent action, WWE has faced considerable backlash from fans. The situation presents a conundrum for WWE creative. They cannot afford to make Ripley look weak by having her lose the championship, but they also cannot ignore the calls for her to defend the title regularly. Stripping her of the title might be a viable alternative, but it's a decision that needs to be approached carefully. One plausible option WWE has is to enforce a new rule that requires the women's champion to defend the title within a specific time frame. This could be a means to address the concerns surrounding Ripley's limited presence in recent weeks and set a precedent for future champions. Adam Pearce, as a prominent authority figure, could be tasked with enforcing this rule and insisting on a title defense for Ripley in the coming week. However, with Ripley seemingly without any female competitors on her level, WWE may need to explore other creative solutions to ensure a compelling title defense. One possibility could involve intergender matches, where Ripley could face male competitors like Dominic Mysterio, who might inadvertently cost her the title. The decision-making process for WWE is crucial here, as it will impact the credibility of both Ripley and the Women's Championship. While fans have expressed frustration over Ripley's lack of presence, the company must consider the long-term implications and storyline development. Ultimately, whatever choice they make, it should be executed with thoughtfulness and respect for Ripley's character and the value of the women's championship. In conclusion, the situation surrounding Rhea Ripley's women's championship reign is complex and poses a significant challenge for WWE. Fans expect to see her defend the title more frequently, 
but creative solutions are required to avoid undermining her dominant persona. Whether WWE decides to enforce a title defense or take a different approach, the key is to strike a balance that preserves Ripley's credibility while addressing fan concerns about her inactivity. Only time will tell how this situation unfolds and what the future holds for Rhea Ripley and her women's championship reign.